Well, hello everybody. Welcome back to my channel. I have created another portfolio and I want to do a little flip through and show you what I did and you'll be able to find this in my Etsy shop. So I've got it tied together with some sorry silk and I added this little beaded dangle here. I want you to see how cute that is. It's got a little beaded heart on it. Isn't that precious? So this is removable if you wanted to take it off and then let's open it. I'm going to show you. These are so much fun to make. I love it. So it's another little, um, has a little flap closure like that. Okay, so let's look at the front cover. I've created a cluster here that's got this beautiful lady and it's got this little banner here that says date. Now I did not write a date on there. I started to like 1920s or 30s, but I thought, you know what, I'm going to leave that and let the recipient put what they want on there. Okay, on the inside of this flap, I've got these little miniature library pockets. And each little pocket has some tags, a couple of things um, down inside there. I think I put two things in every pocket. Just some little ephemera tags and things. So that's what's down in there. Okay, open it up. And on this page, I've got these beautiful, these are washi stickers um, that I recently purchased. And I've just put a little corner heart holding them down there. So these pages have the magnets that I love. You know I love that. So inside here, I've got a layered butterfly. Now this is a cardstock butterfly, but it also has a layer of wax paper butterfly on top of it. So it gives it a little bit of dimension. And then inside this one, I've got this cutie, patootie little girl. Is she precious? So, so cute. So close, close. Okay. Um, let's open it here. And let's see, we'll start over here. Over here, I've got three miniature envelopes. And each envelope has a little miniature something, something down in there for you to explore. And then I've got a little corner pocket. And in my corner pocket, I have just, I'm sorry, four envelopes. This one was hidden. So I've got four envelopes. And then I've got just some tags and some um, stamped tags that I put in there. Birds. Look how pretty. Look how pretty. I love it. Love it. Love it. All right. So that goes in that corner. All right. On this page, I've got one of my little um, string figure eight string closures. And so let's see what's inside. This is a gatefold. We open the gatefold and there's this gorgeous lady image behind a piece of vellum. So there she is in all her glory. <laughs> and then there's some beautiful lace there. And so this just wraps that way and this way and this way and that way and this way. Okay, there we go. Now, down here, I've got a little coin envelope. This one opens off to the side. And inside this little envelope, I've just got a little booklet, a little journaling spot from a beautiful digital print. And it just tucks in that little heart. Now, on this page, I have four vellum pockets. And I've added some glitz and some different things. But each pocket has two tags in it. All right, so you can see the tags through the pocket, and then I edged them with lace on the top. And then there's that part. All right, so closing it back up, let's look at the back side. On the back side, I put a, there's my stamp, of course. I've got this bookmark. Um, this was a Friday freebie from... Who does those? Oh, Friday Freebie Digitals. Oh, shoot. I want to give her the credit. Um, I'll have to link it below because right now I can't think of her name. But this is a digital that she gives away every Friday. And it's a bookmark inside of a little pocket. And so she gives you both of these images. 
and then which you can do them separately or you can do them back to back like I did. I chose to do them back to back. I added a little tab and also in her Friday freebie are these little circle images that I put on a little scallop circle and just added a little crystal at the bottom. Okay, so this goes behind here. Now this is a belly band that I made. So it has a swing tab that holds it closed. And if you open it, you've got some more journaling space, which I did some stenciling. So that just closes like that. That holds it closed. So that is my latest little portfolio, guys. And like I said, you can find it in my Etsy shop. Thanks for watching. Have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.